survey drawing utility functions welcome to lesson on e survey lists related to survey drawing utility functions in this chapter you will learn functions related to grid traverse correction finding latitude longitude of a given point and more draw grid with given grid interval a grid is a pattern of parallel lines intersecting at right angles and forming squares or rectangles it is used to identify precise position which can help one locate a position accurately on the surface of the earth or map sheet using d grid command grid lines can be drawn easily at given intervals d grid command will also annotate all the grid lines with respect to its easting and northing snap text to the nearest point on the grid with the given grid spacing Using SNP, the selected texts are moved to grid point of a given grid interval value. For example, if there is a text at Easting 100.234 and Northing 94.987, the nearest grid point for the interval value of 5 is Easting 100 and Northing 95, and SNP command will move this text to 100, 95. By using SNP command, all the selected text can be snapped to their respective nearest grid points. Latitude Longitude of a Selected Point To find out the latitude or longitude of a given point in a drawing, use FLL command. For this you need to first set datum, hemisphere and zone of the drawing, which can be done using STS command. After doing this setting, if you pick a point using FLL command, Latitude and longitude of the given point are immediately created as text in the drawing. Traverse Correction Using TC command, you can correct the traverse and insert a gale stable with all the calculation details at the specified point in the drawing. It also exports the data in the Excel file which will get stored in temporary folder. This program does traverse adjustment for both open and closed traverse survey. Traverse correction can be done using transit or bordage or crandall methods paste clean text when point data are collected from various total stations it may so happen that at same easting and northing there may be two or more elevations using such overlapping data if you try to triangulate or generate contours then triangulation may not be possible as there will be multiple levels in same easting and northing and the program will not be able to make out which data to be used you need to process the data and clear extra point at a specific easting and northing. Use PCT command to create new set of elevation texts which are unique for a easting and northing combination in a drawing. Sea level type elevation representation of text and block. Representation of survey data on the ground and in sea differs. You represent elevations as 34.560 in the ground whereas the same data is represented in sea level as 34 and 560. Two different text. Using SEA command, normal elevations can be converted as labels which represent sea level. Thank you. In the next section you will learn lists related to setting out.